Ben Affleck and ex-wife Jennifer Garner reunite for parenting duties in Los Angeles. They may have called time on their 12-year marriage, but Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner are still close. The former couple, who officially filed for divorce back in April, stepped out in Los Angeles on Saturday with their eldest daughter, Violet. There appeared to be no tension between the Batman star and his ex, both 45, as they chatted in a parking lot. Their outing came just one day after Ben was seen visiting the Rehab Recovery Center in L.A. on Friday. The Oscar-winning star has been focusing on his sobriety after a rehab stint in February after going public with his alcohol addiction in March. I have completed treatment for alcohol addiction, something I've dealt with in the past and will continue to confront, he wrote on Facebook at the time. Clearly committed to his sobriety, the actor has visited the rehab center several times over the last few weeks. Smiling widely during their outing, Jen looked chic in a pair of cropped black pants. She also wore a cream-colored sweater and black loafers. The 13 going on 30 actress appeared fresh faced under her cat eye sunglasses. Her long brown hair was pulled back neatly in a high bun, and a top handbag sat on one shoulder. Ben was also dressed casually for the outing, stepping out in dark blue jeans. He also wore a maroon check shirt under a navy blue jacket. The part time director also donned grey sneakers and sported a bushy beard. Meanwhile, their 11-year-old daughter looked sweet in a pink and orange printed skirt, which she teamed with a printed white t-shirt. She also wore a fluffy white coat over the top. The trio appeared to have stepped out for a morning coffee together, with Ben and Jen both seen clutching beverages as they made their way back to their cars. Ben is currently dating Saturday Night Live producer Lindsay Shukus, 37, who was in New York working on the long-running series. Speaking about her split from the actor, Jennifer confessed she was disappointed the couple couldn't make it work. It was a real marriage, she told Vanity Fair in March last year. It wasn't for the cameras. And it was a huge priority for me to stay in it and that did not work.